Well, Anwar, a bit of a cracker for our second game of pre-season. How did you feel the game went today? Yeah, listen, first and foremost, it was important that new players coming back got some minutes in their legs. Um, a lot of boys coming back from you know the off-season. So everyone come through unscathed, played a new system, uh, we rotated, lots of you know, new trialists, you know, some of the academy boys. So you know, overall, good day at the office. The score was a bit bizarre, and I probably don't want many games like that um, in the future. But you know what I think? It's sometimes the results are irrelevant and sometimes to a point the performances are also. I think it's about giving people the opportunity to get their fitness up, get back into the routine of things. And um, some of our younger players, it's great that uh, some of them can sort of play in the, uh, in the first team and, and do very well. So and listen, pleased overall. Listen, everyone come through unscathed, that's the main thing. Because a lot of people would argue so far, our starting lineup would, that was our strongest lineup so far, but a couple of youngsters involved from the off with the likes of Tommy and Alfie as well. First of all, how do you feel they did and you know, how do you think we did as a whole in that first half? Yeah, I thought, listen, it was uh, really good to see Tommy score a couple of goals. I thought it was a threat. Alfie's uh, energy and endeavour was brilliant. But I think players from our academy, when they step into the first team, they're gonna, only going to learn when they play in these environments, play in these games. They're training with us every single day and they do really, really well. But it's about you know, dipping them into our first team environment at matches where they can really learn. But I was really pleased with them too today. I thought in the first half, you know, at times we, we used the ball really well. I think it was you know, an early goal they scored you know, from a free kick. But other than that, we were 3-1 up and it was, it was good. We were good. We were you know, playing some good football and scoring some goals, creating chances. It was always going to be a day where you've got 20 players here, trialists, young players. We want to give everyone a go. I think there was wholesale changes in the second half. And I think that probably complements and you know, gives you a reason why the score was the way it was. They had about 10 changes. We had 10 changes. But it's a new formation for some, and with a lot of changes, that's sometimes what happened. But really pleased with the young lads, pleased that everyone come through, minutes in the bank, um, starting to familiarise themselves with each other. And um, yeah, looking forward to the next one. Because of course, our new signing, Kevin Locko, started from the off as well. How do you feel who he did in his first appearance? Yeah, I think, listen, Kevin brings an air of experience. Um, you know, he's a leader, he's loud, he's solid. Really pleased with him. Um, it was good to see him with Giles and Jules at the back, you know, Cody playing in the second half. So that was exciting. You know, you know, pleased with the new boys. Uh, good to get you know uh, a look at Jaden. You know he's a he's a player that's young, always wants the ball. You know, really exciting, and um, obviously pleased that Mo scored a few goals as well. He's a friendly striker. You know, I think Tommy got two, and Mo got a hat trick today, so that was really good. You mentioned the system there as well. Obviously, we're looking to play a three at the back today. Is that something you want to see going forward? Or something we can do in the when the league starts? So it's something you're just experimenting with. Listen, we uh, yeah we're looking at something this year that would you know complement the players that we got, and that's what we try today. Um, I think we'll be working on that moving forward. But I think we've got some players here this year that can adapt and we're flexible to do a few things but you know with some of the good defenders that we've got that's probably a way we're going to go forward it's certainly the way we did today and in the first half I thought we was really good you know you had a really fluid system centre halves you know driving on and, and joining attacks our wing backs were scoring and creating so that was really good today uh, obviously in the second half when you've got lots of trialists and you're asking them to play in a system they're not familiar with uh, sometimes that can be difficult but you know pre-season is all about working you know planning these sorts of games you know learning little things about your team about individuals working on little movements and, and, and set plays and um, that's what you know that's what pre-season is all about and of course it is a bit of a local derby as well so it's great to see like you said 600 just over fans here and supporting the teams yeah I was really pleased with today in terms of 600 there was an atmosphere they saw loads of goals the pitch was really nice uh, it was it was lovely and hot so listen, as far as a pre-season um, game goes, we're really pleased with it. Uh, loads of goals for the neutrals and the fans that have come back and watched football, probably haven't for a little while, and just a fantastic day really. So um, let's go on to the next one and, 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 and try and just keep improving and, and building that squad. Just a word on Mo Betham as well, getting a hat-trick today. I know it's a pre-season game, but it's always good for your striker to get onto a goal-scoring rate. Listen, a striker wants to score whatever game he plays in, even if it's a training game or a, a pre-season friendly. And listen, they're a decent step free side, and I know a lot of their players, and they, they turned up and they wanted to have a right go today. So for Mo to score a hat trick, you know, I, I, I was um, unsure why he didn't want to take that last penalty, but he gave it to Harvey because that would have been four. But Tommy scored, Harvey scored, Mo scored a hat trick. So good daddy office for them, and that's something going to be amazing for their confidence moving forward. And of course, we're back here again at Farmers Ground, but playing Sutton, the newly promoted Sutton League Two side. How do you feel we'll fare next week? Yeah, that's going to be a really difficult game. They're a good side, obviously, won our league and really recruited well. Um, so that'll be an interesting test. But the pitch is great, and I think, like I said, we've got another week in the bank. So looking forward to that test next week. Are you in with a shot? More information in the description below. Click here for the next video. Click here to subscribe. Stop.